the tutorial I'm doing today is for Wednesday Adams as a Halloween costume for foundation which I am using my actual foundation which is L'Oreal True Match in um, I can't remember it's like ivory or whatever the paintless one is so I'm just gonna take a little bit on the back of my hand not loads because there's no need to waste all your makeup on a Halloween look and I'm just gonna take a pinch of suspicious looking white powder which I promise you is just eyeshadow okay it's got weird quickly so I'm gonna mix those two together in my hand it's a probably something like a white face paint mixed with it would be really great I'm just trying to do it with something that maybe you might have so if you do if you do have somewhere near you which sells white face paint which will be pretty easy around Halloween I'm sure like the pound shops and stuff will have them um go and use some of that but i'd say don't go completely white you're not doing vampire look you're just doing pale the foundation is now done next we're going to do eyes so for the eyes i'm going to take a matte black eyeshadow i'm actually using one from this sleek ultra matte v2 palette and it's just the matte black here so on a real techniques base shadow brush and I'm just going to take a bit of it, tap off the excess and pat that right all over my eyelid. Take a MAC 217 brush and just blend that over the top. A black MAC Coal pencil in Smolder. Just dab that on close to the line. This is just to keep the line looking nice and dark. There we go. And just do the same on both sides. And then I'm going to take my angled brush, I can't remember what this is called, from Real Techniques and just smudge that out. So now that's done, I'm just going to blend a little bit more with my 217. And then I'm going to take another angled brush, this one is just a Salon Services 412. Take the same black matte eyeshadow and just run it under my eye. Just under, don't worry, again it can look messy. It can look just really bad. That's kind of what we're going for here. It's going to be really smudgy. So yeah, just smudge that under the lower lash line. I'm going to take the same matte black shadow and just go right back over and deepen along the lash line. Just to keep that really, really dark. And smudge it up as I go, focusing more on the outer corners with the darker colour. Just blend it out. So that's kind of what we're going for. This really smudgy, maybe smudge underneath as well. Black eye, as it were. Like that. Take my smolder eye pencil again from MAC, line the insides and tight line my eyes. my HD brow kit in bombshell you just use any brow kit you have if you do have a brow kit if not any dark eyeshadow will be absolutely fine so I'm using the darkest shade which really is too dark for me but since we're doing this darker look I think it'll be fine I want them to be quite defined I think it looks good if your eyeshadow goes in just to the corners there. There we go. Uh, it's going to be a greyish colour. 
that I have on my base shadow brush and just go along where I would contour. brush and just blend it out a little bit try and make it a little bit more natural but as you can see it adds a more gaunt effect to the look which is what we're going for all right so now i'm going to take my maybelline the four c's mascara but you can use any mascara you've got really and i'm just going to run that through my lashes nothing's fancy MAC Russian Red. I'm just going to do the outside of my lips. I'm going to leave the middle. So, I don't want any black on this, so that's why I'm doing this first. So, go right around the edges. I'm going to take my black eyeliner again. Again, I'm using MAC one. And I'm just inside my lips, just a little bit and then smudge out to create a kind of dead effect. All done with the ombre lips, the eyes, the dark eyes. Hope you like it. Like I say, all the photos from the outfit and the whole costume will be on my blog and I'll leave the blog post down below. And I really hope you like it. If you do like it, maybe you could subscribe to my blog, which is on Blog Love, and you'll see the link on there. Until then, I do have a couple of clips just that will follow of my outfit that I filmed with my brother on. Well, I will film with my brother in about 10 minutes. So I really hope you like it and I'll see you soon. Bye!